Hey everybody, Matt Mazur, DSM for South Central Saskatchewan. Going to talk a little bit about our uh, Alpine injection kit that we have here. Um, it's a really simple idea. Essentially what we're doing with it is injecting liquid inoculant in furrow with our pulses. So we're using a uh, compatible product, call your DSM and they'll fill you in on what, what products we're using. But essentially what happens is the pump, your main pump from your Alpine system, whether it's ground drive, electric, hydraulic, doesn't matter. It'll feed up through this line into this three-way valve. And then the three-way valve either selects a bypass around the system or you turn it and it'll make the system active and it'll flow through here. And as it flows through this pump, it's creating some suction inside there and sucking out of the bottom of our tank. Now as it does that, this ball will float up and down inside this tube to let you know that it's operating. And you always try to mount this so you can see both the level of the fluid in the tank as well as the ball from the cab of the tractor or on a camera or whatever works for you. But you want to make sure that you can see both of those things as you're operating in the field. So the injection system, there's a, a chart that's on the injection system that tells you based on the, in, the injected rate versus your rate of your G22 or your Alpine product and what rate to set the, the injection at. And it's just a simple screw on here to change it and you follow this chart and set it essentially at that percentage of, of injected fluid through your main flow. So from the kit, then it feeds back up to the pump and goes up to your manifold system, whatever system it is.